talking with, Case? I'm just on the phone with FedEx. They just delivered the newsletter. Oh, serious? Yep. All right, well, I guess get it. You got, it. You got the newsletter? It's the newsletter. It's the Titan Teller. Oh, my goodness. Look at this. Look at all these papers. And you, you. you can read it on Canvas as well, and you can print it out. How awesome is that? Thank you, FedEx. All right, well, today is April 16th, 2021, and since nothing unique is happening today, we're going to celebrate National High Five Day, which happened yesterday. But like, COVID, so we can't high five at all. Yeah, there we go. All right. On to weather with Graham. Good morning, Titans. Today's weather is gonna be a high of 58 and a low of 55 and cloudy. Saturday is gonna be a high of 60 and a low of 57, part, partly cloudy. Sunday is gonna be a high of 63 and, and a low of 56. Monday is gonna be a high of 63 and partly cloudy. Tuesday is gonna be 66 and still partly cloudy. And Wednesday is gonna be partly cloudy once again with a high of 65, and Thursday will be all sun with a high of 62. Back to you guys. Thank you, Graham, for the weather. Now on the birthday to David. All right, guys, happy birthday to these special people. All right, we got Kate Jones, Tanav Pathanagol, Noah Kersensi, Lily Gorman, William Hooper, um, Dylan Shepard. Did you know it was your birthday? Oh my gosh. Okay, William Shepard, too. Now we got Chloe Walker, Evelyn Schock, Kareen Ramchander. Thank you. Whoa, wait, it was my birthday? All right then, I guess it was my birthday. That's kind of cool. I didn't know. Yeah, I guess it was my brother's birthday as well. So, I didn't know that either. <laughs> I didn't know anything, apparently. So, anyways, thank you, Aiden. Let's move on to sports with Casey. Hey Titans, this weekend you can go to Dick's Sporting Goods and get a discount of 20% off as part of the NCISAA Students, Faculty, Staff, Parents, and Alumni Discount Weekend. So go ahead, use the coupon that you see on the screen and get your discount. If you're interested in participating in high school basketball open gyms, we have more information on the Canvas pages, and there's a Google form that you should fill out to be added to the Canvas page so you can access all the information about the open gyms. Good luck to all of our teams that are playing today, and come out to support them as they take on Rollsville next week. All right, thank you, Casey, for the sports. Now on to some school-wide announcements. We've got an art walk coming soon on April 28th from 5 to 7 p.m and it's going to feature a lot of cool art, some nice music from performing arts, some food trucks, and more. That sounds pretty fun. It does. Yeah. And then, of course, junior high has got their own spring formal as well. They can do some weird dance moves to their heart's delight on April 30th. I remember those old days. I don't. I don't look back on them fondly. Um, and then there's also prom, which is May 22nd for the high schoolers, and tickets are now available. There are $45 for a single and $80 for couples tickets. Will you be going? Probably not. Ah. The Titans, I want to see you there. I want to see you there too, as well, Thales. You've got to show up. You see them there if you're not there. Exactly. All right, Case, how do we stop the spread? We got to keep our masks on, wash our hands, Cover our claps and sneezes, we got masks on anyway, and follow the blue titan arrows. There we go. You gotta, you gotta walk the right way. Can't be going in the wrong direction. Tough. You get flagged down by a tree. There's only one direction, the most epic band ever. No. <laughs> and in clubs and other news, the NEHS is opening its applications until April 30th. Contact Ms. Kimball at Venture School. The coding club begins next week. Contact Mr. Wright to secure your spot now. NEHS tutoring is still going on after school, 3:45 to 4:30, online and online and virtual. That's the same thing. Dang it! Oh, okay. Online and in person at the school. Community service hours. Please make sure you turn them in soon. May 1st. Deadline is coming up, Titans. Also. Ignore that typo. I don't know how to read. Anyways, moving on to Club Showcase. This week, it's Crochet Club. That sounds pretty interesting. Here's Jeff Zia to talk about it. Hello, Titans. Good morning, and welcome back to Club Showcase. 
Today we're going to be learning about the Crochet Club, and we should have a special guest here soon. Hello, Titans. You're in Crochet Club? Yes. I did not know that. Well, what can you tell me and all of these Titans about the Crochet Club? We usually have a pretty small group, but we still have fun. And sometimes a few of us will work on the same project, and other times we do our own thing. Speaking of which, do you have an example that you could show us? How did you know? And yes, I recently made this little thing. That looks amazing. I wish I could do that. And now, suppose our good friend Nikki Nomisara Smith was joining. What would she need to know? How did I know you were going to say that? Well, it meets from 3.45 to 4.30 on Thursdays every other quarter, but not this one, so she would have to wait until next year. But she would be very welcome then. Miss Lindsay is running it this year, but next year it will be Mrs. Jatan. Good to know. Would you need to bring your own supplies? That would be useful, but there's also a bin for if you forget or if you really like a color there. Okay, thank you. Now you can go up to wherever it is you came from. Goodbye, Titans. This is Jadzia. Follow the Thales Blue Arrows. And this is also Jadzia. Still follow the Thales Blue Arrows. Finally, we've got some words with Sarah Gray, so I hope you listen to them, Titans. That's it from us. Now, have a good weekend and listen to these cool words. Good morning, Thales Academy. This is Sarah Gray with a few words of wisdom. Are you a person who finds it difficult to ask for help when you need it? Sometimes it's easier to offer to help others, isn't it? But listen up. When someone else helps you, it benefits them as well. In other words, in helping others, we shall help ourselves, for whatever good we give out completes the circle and comes back to us. When people help one another, even in small ways, they help themselves. Today, look for ways to be helpful and don't be afraid to ask for help if you need it. When we serve one another, everybody wins. With something to think about, this is Sarah Gray. Make it a great day or not, the choice is yours. Please stand for the pledge.